What up, Bills Mafia? Z-Bot here with the Buffalo Fanatics, and we are stoked to be announcing the launch of our brand new app, the BF Network, available on the Apple App Store and the Google Play Store. This bad boy has everything. It has all your up-to-date... What up, Bills Mafia? Z-Bot here with the Buffalo Fanatics, and we are stoked to be announcing the launch of our brand new app, the BF Network, available on the Apple App Store and the Google Play Store. This bad boy has everything. It has all your up-to-date Buffalo Fanatics articles, all of your Buffalo Fanatics YouTube content. It's got our shop where you can easily browse our collection of products and purchase right in the app, but the best, feature of this app by far is the BFGM off-season simulator. This simulator allows you to literally become the general manager of the Buffalo Bills. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use the BFGM off-season simulator. I'm gonna give you a full rundown of how it works and all the awesome functionalities that it has. So let's jump right into it. So here it is, the BF Off-Season GM Simulator. Guys, you are going to love this thing. It's sweet. And with no football on right now, we're all looking for something to fill the void. Why not become a GM and try your hand at making the Bills a better team in 2022? So we're gonna enter the simulator. And right here you can see it asks you exactly that. How can the Bills take that next step? You're about to go through a simulation of the Bills offseason and make all the decisions. Who to sign, who to draft, it's all up to you. Let's check it out. So you hit start, and right off the bat here, it's going to show you a list of the current free agents that the Bills have on the roster. And you can scroll through the entire list. And as you can see here, we currently do not have enough cap space to re-sign any of the free agents that could potentially leave the team at this current moment. So what we're gonna have to do is clear some cap space. At the top, you can see that the current cap space for us right now is minus $1,599,316. So we are gonna need to cut some players on the roster in order to free up some cap room and re-sign some guys that are currently on the roster or maybe some guys that are on other teams that we're looking to take in during free agency this coming season. So when you click on clear space, you'll see the entire Bills roster, their position, their name, the amount of money that they're set to make against the cap, and then underneath the cut section is where you can cut players to free up your cap space. So we'll just go through here and do a random simulation. Doesn't mean any of these guys should be cut or will be cut. Just a random walkthrough here to show you how this simulator works. So we'll cut Cole Beasley. We'll scroll down, we'll cut Mitch Morse. We'll cut Tyler Medikevich. We'll cut AJ Klein. We'll cut Cody Ford. And we'll cut Daryl Williams. So as soon as you cut six players, you can see the option to cut players disappears. The max amount you can cut is six. Now let's see how much cap space we have now. Wow, we went from negative 1.6 million to 27.5 million cap space at our disposal. So now we can go over to free agents and the sign button now pops up. Beforehand, you weren't able to sign any of these guys because there was no cap space, but now we have enough to do what we wish with. So just for an example, we'll re-sign Emmanuel Sanders for one year at 3 million. Keep Mitchell Trubisky at the backup for one year at five million. For the sake of saving some money here, we'll do two years, seven million for Isaiah McKenzie. Little dirty, my man. Keeping him on the roster for two years, seven million. So that is reflected into the cap space, and now we have just over 16 million to play with. Now you can go through the whole list here and re-sign whoever you'd please, and you can do this again and again and again trying out different formulas to see what you think works best for the Bills. Once you decide who you wanted to cut and who you wanted to re-sign, you click the Advance button, and now you have the option to sign free agents that are not currently with the Buffalo Bills. So you can see here, we have a ton of options. We have Von Miller, we have Chandler Jones, 
Now the people that we have the ability to sign will be shown in full white with the sign button. The players that we don't have enough money to bring in will be grayed out without a sign button. So going through here, a long list of guys that we could bring in if we so choose. So just for the sake of this simulation, we'll sign the recent Super Bowl champion, Von Miller, to the Bills for two years, 10 million. And that immediately is reflected in the cap space. Now we have over $11 million to play with. And you can go through here, sign whoever you'd like, both on the Bills roster and not currently on the Bills roster. Once you've done that, it's time to go to the draft, baby. Yes, you are in control of the Buffalo Bills 2022 draft. And this part of the simulator is my personal favorite. It is so much fun. You click go to draft and start draft. And as you can see here, it's simulating the entire 2022 draft. All the teams prior to the Bills are simulated until the Bills get to the clock. And with the 25th pick in round one, you can now select who you want the Bills to take in the draft. And you can sort it any way you wish, by position or the top 50. So for the sake of the simulation here, we'll just go to top 50 and take one of the best available at a position that we feel like the Bills might need some depth in or an upgrade at the starting position. And let, let's just go with a cornerback here. We'll go with Martin Emerson who is currently ranked 29th overall in the remaining draft class. So in order to draft the player, you hit the green plus button and that's it. Boom. You just drafted your guy. The draft continues to simulate until the Bills next pick. And just like that, you're on the clock again with the 25th pick in the second round. Now you can view the pick history of other teams right here and see who has been taken off the board by other teams. And then right here under Bill's picks, you can see who you picked in the draft. You can also make a trade, which is awesome. So let's find a random trade partner here and see if we can work out a deal. So just looking here, let's, let's go Minnesota Vikings. Okay, so the Bills have the 25th overall pick in round three. The Vikings have the 13th overall pick in round three. Say the Bills want to move up and get somebody that they really like earlier in round three. We'll give them our 25th pick in round three. We'll give them our 25th pick in round four. And we'll give them our 25th pick in round five for their round three 13th overall pick. We make the offer. It's accepted. Boom. Pick is ours now. We currently own the 13th overall pick in the third round. Definitely overpaid for it, but maybe he's a gold jacket guy down the line. We'll see. Now, it doesn't always go through, obviously. I think we overpaid a little bit there. It was accepted, and now we own that pick. But say we go to trade again, and we'll go to the Cowboys here, for instance. So as you can see here, the Bills now have less picks because the trade that we made with the Minnesota Vikings has been reflected in the amount of picks that we have remaining. So let's try to make a trade that won't go through to show you what happens when a team doesn't want to make a deal with you. So the Cowboys have the 13th overall pick in round three. We'll try and trade them our sixth overall pick in round six. Obviously, they're not going to make this move, but I'll make the offer. And as you can see, it's rejected. If I wanted to make a move with the Cowboys, I'm going to have to restructure that deal in order for it to get accepted. This simulator is freaking awesome. You can spend hours on this thing. There's an infinite amount of combinations that you can try out as the general manager to pursue a better Buffalo Bills team in 2022. Try it out right now. Download the BF Network app on the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store. Put on your general manager hat and see how you can make the Bills a Super Bowl contender in 2022. And we wanna see what you come up with too on this simulator. So make sure to tag us on all of our social accounts with what you come up with, who you drafted, who you cut, who you signed in free agency. We wanna see it all. There's a million different ways to work it. So we're very, very excited to see what you all come up with. Thanks so much for tuning into this one. And we hope you enjoy the brand new BF Network app from us here at the Buffalo Fanatics. And as always, go Bills.